Hi students, it's Mr. Nguyen. Welcome to another example of uh, solving quadratic equations using uh, Desmos graphing calculator, okay? Let's take this example um, right here. I'm gonna copy this example. Now notice this, e this uh, equation is written a little bit different than what we're used to, right? So we're gonna have to um, sort of move up the, all the terms to one side and then the other side would be y equals, right? So what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna move the 50 back to the left-hand side, which makes it negative 50, and then combine with the plus 10 to get a negative 40. So I, I have to do some preliminary algebra before I can type this into the equation. So, but anyway, go to desmos.com. So if you open a page and go to desmos and then graphing calculator, um, you know, where you can enter your equation. I'm going to copy and paste, but I'm going to change this up a little bit. First of all, I'm going to change this to a square because it's a quadratic equation. So shift six, which will square that. And then I'm going to take this 50 away and I'm going to put it on this side and combine it with the 10 to make a negative 40. And then on the other side, it will be y equals. And so there's my quadratic graph, right? There's my parabola. Well, how do I solve this? Well, solving the parabola means looking for the x-intercepts of the graph. So uh, right here, it shows you right away two x-intercepts, right? So this is just a matter of spotting them. So one of them is at negative 7.472. So I'm going to go ahead and plot those points for you. Negative 7 point, what was it again? 0.472, right? 472, yeah. I'm gonna go here, negative four, 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 seven, two, comma, zero. So, and you can actually label that, and you can say uh, root or solution one, or you can say zero one, or root one, if you want. Um, you can say x equal negative 7.472. So that's one answer, right? And if you move to the right, whereas the other x-intercept is, that's your other solution. So it's the positive version of 1.472. So if you go over here and plot that point, 1.472 comma zero, and then you can label that, and you can call it root two, x equal 1.472. And there are your two x-intercepts, which are, which are also the roots uh, or the solutions of this equation. Now, if you want to see the whole graph, um, take your two finger and just zoom out on this graph. And you can see the entire um, graph with the vertex and everything, okay? But uh, for the purpose of solving, you just need to see the, the root or the x-intercept. Um, I hope that helps, and I hope you guys use uh, Desmos uh, more often um, whenever you don't have your TI graphing calculators, okay? This is still a good tool if you have access to the internet. All right, thanks for joining me, and I will see you in the next example. Bye-bye.